is up ladies and gents welcome back to the channel we are yet on another reaction video this time we're going to be checking out company of heroes 3 i know absolutely nothing about this game all i know is that it's kind of like a tactical top-down war game that is it that is all i know but apparently it's coming to console so i'm here checking out the gameplay trailer with you lovely people if you do enjoy the video guys don't forget to leave a thumbs up and please consider subscribing if you want to see more reaction videos like this one without further ado let's have a gander end of this month and it's a Sega as well hmm her dark side well it looks all right is my initial thoughts and feelings I didn't realize this was already on PC so it looks like this is exactly as I imagined it was going to be when I read the title this is a console port so it's a game that's already on PC or is going to be coming out soon to PC and this will be moved over to console shortly after it looks okay. Um, graphically, I think it's quite impressive. The lighting looks really good. I love the vehicles. I love the sort of shading. The Blu-ray tracing looks absolutely amazing. What looks a little bit off for me is the soldiers. The facial mechanics, the cosmetics of the soldiers, the way they move is a little bit clunky. Feels a little bit PS2 slash 3 to me. Um, but other than that, I like... The feel for it it kind of reminds me of command and conquer and sort of like risk there's a little bit of sort of civilization in there i imagine this is just a, an army based game where you go in it's very tactical you deploy units a bit like XCOM. you go in you have to capture objectives and there's a campaign and stuff in there what really surprised me is that there's a co-op campaign and also a pvp campaign uh as well or a mode at least where you can go against other players i imagine the maps are going to be random you might be able to build your own maps your own sort of war error and stuff like that looking at the case on the front it looks like it's going to span across quite a range of errors hopefully um so there's going to be some customization in there and imagine we're going to get to play through a couple of big sort of battles in certain key points in each war so like i said i'm not sure i'm not really sure how to feel about it it's intrigued me but i think this is going to be one of those very niche games if you're into your strategy games you're into your tactical games, you like war-esque type games, I think this is going to be for you. And for me personally, I think I'm going to give this one a go, guys, if I'm honest. I think I am going to try something a little different. So if you want to see this content on the channel, let me know in the comments. Hit me up on Twitter, TikTok, um, on PSN, any of the platforms linked in the channel, just to let me know. But I think I'm going to be doing this one. Probably not a full game playthrough, I probably won't do a campaign, I might do a live stream on it, if you guys want to see it let me know. But it has piqued my interest, I love the look of the vehicles, I think the vehicles, uh, the fact that you can do bombing runs and stuff like that on the map, and it's going to be very tactical, as I said it reminds me very much of XCOM, Risk and Command and Conquer, like Red Alert, those sorts of games in the modern day format. Everything about it looks okay, everything about it looks quite interesting, quite tactical. There's going to be elements to it, I'd imagine, that's going to be more, uh, sort of difficulty spikes. I just don't like the look of the soldiers. For me, they didn't move 
very realistically. The motion capture wasn't great on them. The faces look a bit mannequin-esque, I don't know. But apart from that, it looks like a good game and I will be checking it out. So if you want to see more content on Company of Heroes 3, let me know in the comments. Once again, thank you so much for checking out the video. I will see you again in the very next video or stream. Cheers, guys. Peace.